Kia ora, uh, ko Mataroria Linden tōku ingwa. I work at Middlemore Hospital as a doctor at Kuawatea within Middlemore and as a research fellow doing a PhD at the University of Auckland. Even leaving from Tangaroa to go to med school, I've always had a feeling that I wanted to do more than just medicine and doctoring and to be involved in wider health. Spending time with the students, that's that's so rewarding. Like their wairua and their passion. I mean, they're here in the Health Science Academy. They, I mean, they are inspired. They want to do health. They want to become a doctor or a nurse. They need the opportunities and they want to show them what the opportunities are out there. I talked about trying to reach out, you know, and that's, and that for me, it's like I've had so many opportunities and I feel really privileged to have that. And so now it's, what can I do so that others can have that too? And that's what is always on the back of my mind. It's like, oh, I'm so lucky. And I want other kids to be lucky too. This is exactly what our, our young people need to hear. And they need to hear what the journey is like after this. Thank you for your courage in sharing your story. You know, didn't have this childhood dream of going to Harvard or even going through med school. It, it wasn't on my radar. But neither was research, you know, neither was all the mahi that I'm involved in now. What can I do to fill my kete to bring back? What's different? What can I learn from some of the real experts in health that I can then use back here? Hmm. So that's where how Harvard came about. I got the letter and like a good friend of mine, Connie, she was there and she was like, oh my god, and I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> Welcome to the Papatoi Night Markets. This is Dixon and this is Manaya. Let's check it out. My home is very much Taitokiro and South Auckland. That's where I've spent most of my life. And my partner, Dixon, he's been that influence for me as well in terms of coming out. He was out earlier at med school. And I remember him at med school. He was a few years off behind. And then it was a few years later that we crossed paths again through other friends and I had to take the plunge. It's like I'm, I'm 10 years of keeping quiet, keeping things to myself. And then when he asked me that question, are you gay? You know, like, in my head I was like, it was like facing on a cliff. And I was like, am I gonna jump? And I did. It's been the best, it's been really good. A medical degree isn't just the ticket to being a doctor, it opens so many other possibilities too. So even if they're unsure about exactly what they do next, if they choose to just do something and see where that goes.